A blind man is speaking out tonight after saying he was injured when a Little Rock police officer slammed him to the ground. Fox 16's Drew Petromo has obtained video showing just what happened, and he joins us now live from Little Rock Police Headquarters. Drew? Donna, Little Rock Police say they won't comment on the video until after they're done investigating Eric Wilson's complaint. But we sat down with Wilson and his lawyer today to get their side of the story. I had just got off of work. It was just before 4 o'clock Monday, June 1st. Eric Wilson left his job at Lighthouse for the Blind and missed the bus. So he started to walk home along 65th Street. Show us out at 65th and Lake Beard and we're going to call. Around that time, Little Rock police say they got a call about someone fitting Wilson's description who was running away from or chasing someone and who appeared to be afraid. Hey! Come on, talk to me. Wilson is legally blind and says he only sees shadows. He says he didn't know who it was that was calling him. Could have possibly been getting robbed or, you know, I didn't know what was about to happen. Get your hands back. The officers tell Wilson to put his hands behind his back and then he's taken to the ground. In a police report, an officer said Wilson pulled away violently, causing me to lose grip. And he was afraid Wilson would strike myself or my partner with the handcuff. But Wilson and his lawyer, Reggie Koch, say that's not what the video shows. When they tell him to come over here, he walks toward him. When they tell him, take your hands out of your pockets, he takes his hands out of his pockets. What more do they want? The officer also said they saw a black handle hanging out of Wilson's pocket. It is 1353. But that turned out to be a clock that reads Wilson the time. Why would I get thrown to the ground? If anything, you all should have been trying to help me. Now that night, Wilson says he ended up going to the hospital where he was diagnosed with a strained lumbar. Reporting live at LRPD headquarters, I'm Drew Petromo. Well, you know, I think the obvious question here is, does he plan to file a lawsuit? Well, speaking with him and his lawyer, he's, they say that's something that they're considering. Again, Little Rock police say they are investigating a formal complaint that Wilson filed. Okay. All right. Drew Petromo live for us. Drew, thank you. Today, Mar